So I'm here to review Color CL Contacts. Um, I ordered three pair. I was gonna do my makeup and like try them on, but I'm gonna do both. So the plan is to try these contacts in bathroom lighting first, then take you guys out here in natural lighting. Cause I think that's super important. Sometimes contacts look different with the yellow lighting compared to how they look when you're out and about. I've never ordered contacts from them before, but I'm super excited. I wanna try them without makeup first. For the record, I would rather play in traffic than have people watch me take 15 minutes trying to put these contacts in so <laughs> that's not gonna happen i still have these in the box if you are going to order them just know that you're going to have to sign for them they tried to come and show up and drop the box off and i wasn't there to sign it so i had to go through this whole process go to the post office and pick up the box because they wouldn't re-deliver it so just know you're gonna have to sign for it so already the packaging looks really nice i brought it towards the light a bit liquid solution I've had very good experiences getting contacts in South Korea, so I am a little bit um, happy that this is a South Korean brand of contact. They're so squishy, so squishy, so squishy. I almost forgot I gotta wash my hands before I put in contacts in because you gotta make sure you clean your hands before you put contacts in or else. Okay, so this is Metatron. There's no power to these. You know, I just bought them as is 0.00 or whatever the heck. This is what Metatron looks like in natural lighting. It looks really cool, but as you can see, it still kind of rolls up a little bit. I don't know if it's gonna do that on the other eye, but we're gonna check. These are insanely hard to put in your eyes. If you were new to contacts, I would not buy these. I don't know if it's gonna be just this pair or if it's going to be other pairs, just the color, play, brand, period. I would not suggest going anywhere <laughs> with these for a long period of time. I mean, I'm already blind enough as it is. <laughs> it looks really pretty though, especially in the light. Look at that, that is so intense. It blocks out all the brown, but like, it is a hazard. So you have 20-20 vision, you may be able, not even may, you definitely will be able to see more than I was when I'm like this. Like everything is blurry, but most of that is my fault. Wanna put the glasses on? It gets a little bit better. Peripherals are still locked, you know, I think it's still kind of dangerous, but I can see a little bit better. I can see clear. I actually don't feel like putting the other contacts on. I think I'm just gonna do my makeup and then do the other contacts on other days because the whole process of putting the contact solution in and doing that and then taking another pair out. And I'm good. We gonna do this another day. <laughs> so let's style these first. This is probably gonna be a hot mess because I packed away most of my makeup because I'm in the process of moving. <laughs> so I forgot that I don't have any brushes. I don't have anything, but this is like, what it looks like with some makeup done. It has been a couple hours and it looks like these are holding up well. I will say that these are comfortable. <laughs> uh, they were hard to put in. I can barely see anything with my glasses off, a little bit with my glasses on, but these are extremely comfortable. I'm gonna see how long I can keep these on before my eyes get a little tired because sometimes I feel like contacts put weight on your eyes, if that makes sense. I'm very kind of surprised at how comfortable these are considering how difficult they were to actually get them on my eyeball. I put these contacts in, I couldn't see nothing the whole time I was doing my makeup. I know you're supposed to do your makeup and then put your contacts in, but I can't do that in the future. I do wonder how this is gonna look because it looks very like light, light green. So I wonder if it's gonna cover the brown of my eyes. I thought long and hard about the fact that I was showing like contacts in yellow bathroom lighting when that technically doesn't matter. I feel like natural lighting matters more so they look really good. I have it like as a side because if I go like this it'll pill me out. Blink 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 blink. These don't really roll. These were so hard to get in you guys. These were harder to get in than the red ones. You know how you have a contact and it just stands upright on your finger? These kind of soak into your finger a little bit. They don't just like plop on your eyeball. They're crinkled and then they have to unfold and soak into your eyeball versus other contacts where they kind of just like you bop them boop, and then they kind of pop on. <laughs> they kind of pop on your what is it, the iris? 
<laughs> I hope that makes sense. These contacts are super comfortable. I can actually see out these way better than the red ones. I think it was more difficult for me to see in the red ones because they were red. <laughs> I think it had more to do with the color. These I can see out of my peripherals a lot better. I would feel comfortable going outside in these. I would feel comfortable crossing the street in these. But the red ones, absolutely not. We're gonna go put some makeup on now, I guess. I swear, if it's not one thing, it's another. Where is my camera holding device? Oh, perfect. <laughs> that actually looks really good. I'm so happy. Okay. Okay, villain Deku, I just need, I just have, have been having a hard time finding a wig. So that's been, I have to like shrink down because I'm, I'm tall. How do I make this big? We are not gonna try to ah. Dude, that is definitely 100% broken. The green eyes are giving green. It looks kind of bright on, um, where's my stepping stool? I have a stepping stool because I am tall, but could be taller this is like a mock trial of what i'm gonna go for i don't even know how i'm gonna do the villain deku inspired look video but uh the point is the contacts <laughs> and they're doing their thing they're pretty green it took me probably about 40 minutes to do my makeup they're still comfortable they seem fine as far as intensity i thought they were pretty light but they actually are really intense i'm not gonna be able to show you guys the white out without makeup maybe i'll do that tomorrow <laughs> i'm gonna do the white out with makeup because it has to be like visual k-esque i'm gonna try my best i don't know if i'm gonna be able to pull that off okay so i had the very awful awful idea of putting all my makeup on I'm looking at the mirror right now so that's why you can't see me putting on my makeup on and then putting my lashes on and completely forgetting to put the contacts on so now i am suffering and our cleaning lady is here so i can't use the bathroom mirror and we're gonna try to get this one because it was tough i know i look mad crazy but i promise it'll come together oh huh that was difficult. I was trying to choose like a wig that would match with this. I don't know how I feel about this wig. I really think it's the shirt. Like if the shirt were like a little bit more open, then this would probably look better. But uh, I decided to just go with this hair because I think it looks loads better. Especially with these. Even though I was not able to show these with like without makeup, I think they're pretty good. I don't have any complaints. I've been wearing them for like I would say maybe two hours. At first I was just gonna record them and do a voiceover. I feel like this hair goes way better with the contacts even though it's not about the hair. I, I liked this. Before I had this one on, I'ma show. Let's see if I can get it to focus. This one I actually like more. I think it's cause of like the red in the lip, but this one looks good. I like it. I like it a lot. I think I will be using these a lot. Uh, not the gloves, but like the, the contacts. What this whole thing is supposed to be about. Even though I'm like really happy about the outfit. The red ones are the hardest to see out of as, as far as the peripherals go. This one, I would say kind of medium. The peripherals are still kind of iffy, but the green ones I could see just fine. I feel like the green ones I could see the clearest out of. All of them are comfortable. I have no complaints whatsoever. I've been wearing these for a couple hours, like I said. I like them. I think for $10, it's a steal. They're supposed to last for like a year. Color CL, I think is the name of it. I threw the boxes away. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I got one discounted because I bought two. I don't know if that discount is still running, but check it out. It's funny how the one I actually recorded putting in my eye is the one that went in the, um, that went in the easiest. It, it, these aren't easy to put in. 